Hello, my loves. How are you guys doing today? Today, I am going to show you everything that I got from Top Shelf this Christmas season. Some of these things are just like Christmas decor. Some of them can be like Christmas gifts. So let me show you everything that I got. Okay, first things first, let's talk about these cute hair scrunchies. I got these for a dollar and this one is a little tree with this like velvet looking textured scrunchie and I also got the little reindeer these are obviously perfect for kids but if you're going to the office this is such a cute way to just make small intentions to be in the holiday spirit and I love them so much. I feel like you could wear like two little pigtails or two little buns and these would look so cute. I obviously got these for myself. <laughs> so I feel like adults or kids can wear them. Next up, I got some ornaments and my first ornament was a dollar and it is this little red donut. And the reason why I got a donut is because I love donuts. I love Krispy Kreme donuts. I love Mexican sugar donuts. And so I just thought it fit. It fit who I am as a person. And I got the red donut. I believe they had another color, but I don't remember which color it was. And this is going to be a great addition to my Christmas tree so far. I did buy a lot of my ornaments at the Dollar Tree some of them are from Amazon but a lot of the like really unique ones like my little owl here he's from the dollar store and yeah so I can't wait to add these to my collection the next ornament that I picked up is also a dollar and it's this little like fluffy Christmas tree in white I just think this looks so classic and so beautiful and it'll match for years to come. I love it so, so, so much. Okay, next up, I got this ceramic mug for $3. And oh my gosh, look at how adorable this mug is. It's all white, or I guess you could call this cream, off-white maybe. And it just has a green lip. This cup looks expensive, you guys. Like... I feel like I could see this at like Pottery Barn or something. It looks so classic and so cute and I love it so much. If you gifted this, I'm sure they would not even realize that it was $3. I mean, nonetheless, I think it doesn't matter as long as it's cute and functional, right? But yeah, I love that mug. I also, I went a little crazy with the mugs in there, but they had the cutest mugs. I also got this terracotta bottom $3 mug. And this one says merry and bright with a little car hauling a Christmas tree and gifts. I think this is like one of my favorite mugs ever. I just love the look of it. Again, it feels very expensive and it was only $3. And it, it is food safe, dishwasher, and microwave safe. And I think that's something to like actually be on the lookout for if things are microwave safe, especially if you're going to remove the tag before gifting it, just because most people will put their mug in the microwave. So if they say do not put in a microwave, either advise or leave the tag on there, just a tip. Let's see if the other one says the same. Yeah, dishwasher and microwave safe. Okay, last mug, I promise. It is this Merry Christmas mug in green. And this one was also $3. It's also microwave safe. And oh my gosh, I just couldn't pass on this mug. At first, it was between getting one of these two, and I just couldn't decide, you guys. I couldn't. They also had this one in red, but this green color, I'm just so obsessed with it. For the past two years, I have decorated my house with, like, touches of red, 
and next year I feel like I want just touches of velvet green and this is gonna go great with my decor next year <laughs> So if you guys are new here, hi, welcome to my channel, but if you have seen some of my other Dollar Tree videos, um, you saw me post a $3 soap dispenser for my bathroom and I really loved it that I wanted to go get another one for my kitchen just because I just love having those little touches of Christmas everywhere in my house. But I hadn't got the chance to go back to Dollar Tree so they had some cute 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 um what are these called hand soaps at doll at pop shelf this one is the little santa claus he was five dollars and it is a candy cane scented hand soap so let's smell it i actually didn't open this at the store so let's smell it and see how it smells it smells like a sweet candy cane i don't know it smells good so I'm gonna use it up and once I'm done using the hand soap in here, I'm gonna add some of my favorite dish soap and use this as my Dawn dish soap dispenser because oh, it's so cute. They also had the Christmas tree and the, and like a little gnome, but I wanted Mr. Santa Claus. I also picked up another soap. And this is a foaming hand soap in the scent Vanilla Almond. But you guys, it comes with a little Christmas sweater. Of course I had to get it. They had this scent and then they also had like a peppermint scent. I think it was also like sweet peppermint. Um, but yeah, I don't know. This is so cute and I feel like this would even be such a cute gift. Oh, that's like straight up Christmas in there. That smells so good. So now I have another hand soap. So I might just add this one in the bathroom as well. I don't know. I'll see what I want to do with this one. But the little Christmas sweater, you guys. Ah, oh, how cute. They also had like a green Christmas sweater, but I really liked this one. Okay, this I also thought was really interesting. This is a mocha latte body scrub. And it comes in like a little coffee cup. And I just thought this was so pretty. And like what a cute gift to give to someone. Um, I don't know how to open it. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. So let's open this up so we can smell it. I don't know why I was expecting like a like a brown scrub, but it is this white scrub and it definitely has a hint of like that mocha latte smell. Oh, this smells so good. It's like if you were burning like a like a coffee candle. It smells absolutely amazing. I can't wait to use it. It's all over my hands now. I can't wait to use this. I will let you guys know how I like it, but oh my gosh, what a cute little gift. And I, if I find the prices, I will put them on the screen just because like, I don't know where the receipt is at right now. But okay, let's move on. So that was kind of like the end of the haul for the Christmas stuff. Now I kind of want to show you some stuff that I just found while I was in the store. These items just intrigued me. So I have not tested any of these items, but I do want to test them over the next few weeks. And I also bought some makeup and I want to do like a get ready with me using some of the new makeup that I got in here. So let me show you everything that I got. Okay, this one I guess is not makeup related, but it is a dust cleaning gel for computers, electronics, car interiors, and more. And it is like a little like slimy gel pad thing. And it's supposed to help you like clean areas that are hard to reach. I've seen people even use these in their cars to clean like little hard to reach areas. And I had never seen one of these in person, so. I decided to get it so we're gonna try it out on my dirty 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 um what's it called my keyboard and see if it works 
Ugh, it's so slimy. It almost feels like this could be like a toy. Ugh. It's so like wet feeling on your hands. Anyways, we'll see if that works. And it does leave like a weird chemical smell on your hands. It's not the best, but I'm sure if I wash my hands, I'll get that smell off. This is a dust cleaning gel that I got from Pop Shelf, and we're gonna see how well it works on my keyboard. As we can see here, my keyboard is filthy. That gunk has been sitting on it for a while because I don't use this computer anymore. So now we're just gonna see if this works. I think overall it does an okay job. I like I see some stuff that it picked up, but honestly, I could have done this with like a wet rag. It probably would have been a little bit faster than this. So I don't know. I'm gonna try it inside my car next and see if it works better in my car. But as far as my keyboard, I don't know. I'll just clean it with a towel. Ooh, the next product that I am so excited to use, it is this Hydrating Facial Mist. They had a ton of different scents. Um, I think there's a scent for anybody there. Like they had rose scent, they had cucumber mint, they had white tea and jasmine. No, they had ginger white tea or white jasmine. I don't know what else they had, but I picked up the sea salt and sage. And this is supposed to be a brightening formula that purifies and refreshes. It says great for all skin types and it is ultra moisturizing. It can be used after cleansing, before or after makeup, or anytime throughout the day for a quick burst of hydration. And this stuff smells so good, you guys. Um, it just kind of puts you in like a zen moment now they they did have a different one like they had like this one is the facial mist and they also had a body mist but i'm like why get both so i'm gonna use this on my body too i don't know i'll let you guys know how i like it as soon as i start using it the next product on my list is this creamy clay mask this is by the brand Believe Beauty. Oh my gosh. Okay. So Believe Beauty has a line called Skin, I'm guessing. And this is their detoxifying clay mask. And it helps leave skin appearing refined and smooth. I have been on the search for a clay mask. Um, why that is, is because I want to do it for my underarms. So I normally use aluminum free deodorant and I have a deodorant that's my favorite and it's the Donna Karen cashmere deodorant but I think that one has aluminum so I used it the other day and it caused my skin to break out in a rash so now I want to detoxify my ar underarms using this clay mask so I'll let you guys know how I like this. Now, I don't really use makeup removing facial wipes, but now that I do my makeup often, sometimes I, well, it's kind of hard to like take off my makeup sometimes when I'm like tired. So I'm like, maybe I can use a makeup remover on my way to the bathroom. So by the time that I'm there, m most of my makeup is completely gone and I just have to like quickly wash my face. So I got these collagen makeup remover facial wipes and these were only a dollar, which I thought was a crazy. And it's a pack of 25 and it says it gently removes makeup and nourishes skin barrier. And it is clean beauty approved. I don't really know exactly what that means, but we're gonna test these out and see if they break our face out or not. The next item on my list is another popular brand at Poplush, which is called Found. And this is a brightening seaweed water cream. 
and this is supposed to be like a hydrating moisturizer i believe yeah it provides intense hydration to moisture and plump and it is 92 percent natural and it says apply to cleanse skin for a burst of hydration so we will see how this feels on our face I love water-based moisturizers. They make my face feel so like plump and so fresh and they don't make me feel like weighed down. Like sometimes moisturizers can feel really heavy on your face and I found that water-based moisturizers have the opposite effect on me. It has a weird smell. It doesn't smell bad, but it doesn't smell good. But I guess that's probably like the seaweed. I don't know. I'm so excited to try this. Okay, the next two products, I guess I will show them to you together because it's basically the same thing. But it is, again, by the brand Found. They also have a bunch of makeup at Poplush. And I got these concealers in two different shades. So I could use one as concealer and one as like a contour. So I got the color rich and the color medium. They didn't have a variety of shades, I will mention that. I think they had a variety of shades on their foundation, but not really on their concealers. So the concealers, oh yeah, I was gonna say they must be a new product, but they are because they say new on the packaging. And these last four makeup products are also by the same brand, Found. I picked up this BB cream in the shade Light Medium. I don't know if you guys can see. Oh, there we go. This says it's a BB cream for added moisture and sheer coverage. Uh, so yeah, we're going to see how well this works. They did have foundation there, but... I actually, if you saw my last video, my Dollar General video, I bought the Believe Beauty foundation. So I'm really curious to try that one out. So I thought I would try like a different item for my face with this one, which would be the BB cream. And I also picked up this lip gloss in the shade Sand. I feel like this is such a beautiful winter color and I can't wait to see what it looks on me. I also picked up this Radiant Glow Loose Setting Powder. Oh, and this one is actually by that brand that I was telling you about, Believe Beauty. And this is like a golden pearl setting powder. Now, I wonder how this is going to look on my face because, I mean, it's definitely like a pearl setting powder. I'm very curious and very interested and I can't wait to try this. Okay, and the last two makeup products, I think I said I was almost done, is this Nourishing Cream Blush Tint from Found. And that color is so beautiful. I've never used a blush in a cream form, so I'm so excited to finally use a cream blush. And this one was $4. <laughs> and I also found this. This is a white clay mattifying powder that absorbs oil for a natural matte finish and it is by that same brand found so basically what's in here is cornstarch zinc oxide zinc magnesium titanium and iron so i feel like those are like the same ingredients in the bare minerals that are like SPF proof so I wonder if this is SPF okay this says nothing about being SPF proof so it's just supposed to like absorb oils like throughout the day it says apply after skincare regimen to control excess oil and shine throughout the day so you can apply this after you do your skincare if you want like a matte look without your makeup or after makeup, so maybe like once you're out and about, if you start getting like oily, you can use this to freshen up. So really, really interested about this. I normally like the glow that my face has after I've been wearing makeup for a long time, but sometimes it doesn't look the greatest on camera. 
So I'm gonna try this. I'm, I'm kind of interested to see how well this works. And this is what the formula looks like. So yes, I don't know if I will get to those videos of trying my makeup with you guys for this holiday season. Hopefully I do. I just have a lot of Christmas content that I want to show you guys. But I do, I will eventually get around to testing those items with you guys. But I also want to share with you guys my last three items, technically two because two of them are the same, but I got these sparkle birthday candles. I love buying candles at Dollar Tree. I have found some of the cutest candles and, but I've never seen sparkle birthday candles. So I got these. We are going to a birthday party here soon, so I hope I get to use them. And I also got party sparklers. So how cute is this? Maybe we can use these on Christmas as like a fun way to like enjoy the outside and maybe take some pictures with the sparklers. But yeah, I love Poplush. I love everything that they offer. They offer some great stuff. And I can't wait to start shopping there more often. Let me know what you guys love about Pop, La Pop Shelf. Let me know if you have a specific brand that you really enjoy at Pop Shelf. Or if you would like me to test out some of the brands there. I did see another brand. They're called B. Like B-E. I think that's a new, like, more affordable brand. So let me know if you wanna, want me to test that one. I will be testing out the Believe Beauty brand. That one can be found at Dollar General as well as Pop Shelf. And now the brand found. I can't wait to test them out and see how well I like them. But yeah, that was it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. If you want to see more videos, please go to my channel. There should be a few Christmas hauls there. And also, I like to do makeup related videos, Dollar Tree videos, just anything and everything. I'm there for it. But yes, I love you guys so much and I will see you on the next one. Bye!